<laughs> you know, I'm just doing my thing with my spouse. All of the sudden, bats. Do you really think that wouldn't end horribly? guys, it's Coffee, and today we are back playing the Legacy Challenge Sims 4 Edition. And guys, I have so many things that I need to talk about before we dive into the actual gameplay. It's all about this series, though, so please take a moment to listen to your girl coffee. But uh, basically, I, over the weekend and like earlier this week had looked over and like tried and tried and tried to find the rules for this series because so many of the comments on this series are so controversial and like this is how the series is supposed to be and no these rules are supposed to be this way and yes your sims can have a job no they can't have a job and I watched a ton of other legacy series on YouTube and I like really wanted to get this right. Granted, I never play by the rules. Like I always change things a little bit. That's why we're doing a vampire legacy. You know what I'm saying? But like, I am changing so many things about this series. First and foremost, let me, let's talk about this. First and foremost, we have moved. Uh, we live in the town of Windenburg now. And the reason for that is because as far as I know, the biggest lot we have in this game is in Windenburg. And it's a 64 by 64. There's two of them in Windenburg. How many times can I say Windenburg? But there's two of them. This being one of them. This is the... What lot are you? This is the Dresden house. Also, I have to cheat us some money because we definitely had more money than that. Uh, and I'll explain that in just a second. But that's where we are now. I <laughs> uh, It was between one of two lots. I chose this one because the other lot is on like the fancy schmancy island. And I always choose that lot for my Sims when I play in Windenburg. So I was like, you know what? We're going to do something different this time. We're going to pick a lot kind of in a different area. So I love this, by the way. I know a lot of legacy challenges are set here. So this is very typical. Uh, the second thing is I have decided to not allow my Sims Sims to work. Um, at least not the parents. I am definitely not allowing them to have jobs. Uh, in fact, I'm going to make him quit his job right this moment. Uh, I have realized that it's not really something, it's not really something that's like monster important to have a job because there are so many other skills you can pick up. Like uh, our girl, our beautiful girl, Evangeline Westbrook, uh, or Evangeline, I'm sorry, Evelyn Westbrook has, uh, she has the skill with painting to make masterpieces. There is no reason that she should have a job. Uh, same with our boy, our homeboy here, Caleb. He does not need a job. We are going to keep toughing this out. We actually had about $5,500 before I made this move. And I am going to give it back to us because we earned that money. And the rules that I originally started with were slightly different of what you had to buy from the actual actual um from the actual what am I thinking the store or the build buy mode that you had to buy something different and I bought something that was more expensive so uh, I am gonna let them have their money in fact I'm gonna cheat that to them right now testing cheats true guys I'm giving you true things right now uh money I think they had about five thousand it was like five thousand four hundred and seventy I want to say it was like seventy six dollars so not quite 550, but I just wanted to give them what they had. I put their room, because that's all they have is a room, back. Uh, what else can I tell you? So no jobs. We are going to have Evelyn go ahead and continue being a painter because she's really good at that. We, I think she's like a level seven skilled painter now. And we are going to have our homeboy Caleb here. We're actually going to alter this we are going to change his aspiration and he is going to become a nature and a, a nature person and i want to say yeah he's going to be a freelance botanist and we're going to have him be our collector around town which he won't be able to really go out until nighttime to do those things but 10 out of 10 it's worth we don't need him to really exercise anymore because he's not a bodybuilder so we're going to sell that um, we, so we have quite a bit of money, guys. Do you think, I think we should spend some time actually renovating this house because we have money to do stuff. So I don't see anything wrong with 
you know, expressing ourselves, giving ourselves a bit more space to do things. Okay, guys, so I went ahead and basically just kind of gave us a floor plan to work with, and I think we did really well considering the, like, money that we actually have. Oh, wait, no. Let's have him take care of the baby. So he's going to be on, like, daddy duty. Bounce, change diaper, we'll bottle feed again, we'll rock, we'll cuddle. And I think I'm actually going to have them try for another baby, like, immediately. Um, I also really want Caleb to go and try to get seeds. We also need to be working on their vampire powers, mostly because we need to get the points so that they can be sun resistant. Because this is redon- Oh, <gasps> What? Is he, does he really have perfect sun resistance? Cool. He's the perfect candidate for us to go out and get things to sell because we need the money. So we're going to have him, what's this? Can we harvest this? Okay, now we can view it though. Um... I'm just seeing what I can see, guys. We can have him go fish. I didn't realize he was sun resistant. That makes this so much easier for us. Goodness gracious. Oh, guys, 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 guys. There's a freaking log. Okay, we can go look for frogs. That's what we're going to do next. Um, let me actually pause this. What's, uh, what else can we do? I know we can fish, which we will also do. Uh, I'm just trying to see if I can find... Like, I know there's, like, rocks that we can get, and I'm definitely in the market to try to find those, because sometimes they're worth, like, a metric crap load of money, and that's really important. I want to say, where the heck is it, though? Like, it's, I know, uh, and there's only a few of them. Like, you can't, oh, is that one right there? What's that? What is that? Oh, 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 I found it. I found it. I found it. So we're also going to have him come dig this up. And then we might travel to like the public library or a park or something just to see if we can get our hands on the biznu. Get our hands on some seeds so we can start gardening. Oh, baby Aiden. And before this episode ends, I want them to woohoo. Like that is going to be a thing. Okay. You are a very fast runner, sir. I love him. I'm so glad we married him. Like, this was a good choice. Milk was a good choice. Uh, if anybody knows what I'm referencing, you're the real MVP. Okay, you know, just hide in the bushes. Just, you know. Oh my gosh, I can't even keep up with you. Stop being so fast. 
Okay, so we collected a frog. Apparently, if we find another frog, I didn't even know about this business, but apparently, I don't want your welcome. Like, get out. Does anybody ever really want the welcome? I'm dead serious. <laughs> like, who wants that? Um, we can breed the frogs, though, if we find more than one. Okay, wait, what did we get? Okay, let's pause for a second and take a look-see. We got a spotted leaf frog and we got an emerald. So the emerald is worth 20 the frog is worth 10. Let's go ahead and sell the emerald um, because it's just not really worth much anyways. I th think we can find more than that though. But right now we're going to go ahead and work on fishing. We're going to hang on to our frog until we find another one just to see if breeding them helps us out. Dude, this is so great. I need uh, Evelyn to get this. Well, not really, because he's the one who's going to be doing all of this. So we don't really have to worry about that. Right now, I'm really hoping in this pond that we're actually going to not pull up a fish. I would love it if we could actually pull up an apple or some kind of fruit, because that does happen. I know about apples, at least. You can at least get apples. I love how open world this area feels. Like, I don't have to go anywhere. I don't have to leave my house. I don't have to go to a loading screen. I can do whatever the frack I want, which is awesome. All right. Another, stop catching fish. For once, I don't want fish. All right. You're worth $7. I'm going to sell you two. Oh, you know what? Crap. I shouldn't be selling them because you can make plasma. <laughs> you can make plasma out of fish, I'm pretty sure. So gosh dang it. Hygiene. Okay, he really wants a shower and he is getting thirsty. All right, who are you? Can I drink from you? Nice. Um, yes, I will come compel you. I'm going to do that first just so he's fed, you know, because I think that's uber important. Oh my gosh. The the way you run, boy. The way you run. Run, Forrest, run. Okay. Oh man. I'm glad I kept his dark form the same as his OG because I don't like it when they look scary. Like, it's just me. What? What? No, you will give me a drink. I'm thirsty. What? No, he wasn't. Come on to sit. I'm angry at you now. So now you can do what I say. Get back. Go back. Yeah, now you're stuck there. What do you have to say about that, sir? What do you... And he's just like, I'm going to be on my phone. I don't even care what you have to say for yourself. No, I don't. Oh, I forgot a roof back there. Whoopsies. Screenshot. Yeah, we don't care. <laughs> All right. Uh, we don't need to play games, though. Let's go... First of all, let's fix this freaking roof, because that's going to drive me nuts. That will actually drive me insane. And roofs are free, I found out. So that's a thing. <laughs> Okay, let's go back in. Uh, what's Caleb up to? Also, let me know. Got oh my gosh. Okay, you can go shower. That's fine. That's fine. Um, I also uh, want to know what you guys think of like the new editing style and play style where there's more cuts. I try. I try to only film like no more than two videos a day when I film because I realize that bulk recording and stuff really gets on my nerves and I feel like I'm not happy or peppy or excited to play anything. And I feel like playing the game this way honestly makes me so much happier. So let me know what you guys think of all of that, because I know it's different than what you might be used to, but I'm really like proud of the work that I have been putting out. But you know, like I obviously want your guys's input. Okay. Let's see if there's anybody around here to drink from, or do we have plasma packs? We don't. Um, can we drink from these frogs? Nope. Uh, Hmm. I thought this was a person right here. This like steeple or whatever. I thought it was a person standing on the roof. And I was like, uh, boy, 
<laughs> you might want to get off the roof. Uh, you know, <laughs> might be wise to get off the freaking roof. Okay. Or girl. I thought it was a guy though. <laughs> Okay, so what are you doing? You should be doing things too. You need to be selling your work, girlfriend. Uh, let's go ahead and sell this to the art gallery. The, seriously, this was your competent painting? You're a better artist than this, and I know it. Dang, that was worth a lot of money. Uh, let's do another one of those, because we get almost $500 per painting, which is fantastic. I really wish I knew when this kid head when this kid was aging up so we do unfortunately i didn't want to we do actually have to buy a kitchen <laughs> because we have to buy a kitchen why do we have to buy a kitchen we have to buy a kitchen because we have to be able to bake cakes for birthdays and stuff and yeah and i want to like have a better cooking skill and yeah I'm not super thrilled about it, but I'm going to deal with it. Okay, so we've got this little table and kitchen set up. I think that was everything I needed for the kitchen. We got real poor real fast. We started today with like $5,000 and now we're down to 87. I didn't want to spend it all because I'm trying to be a little careful. Okay, why are you mad? You're really thirsty. And what's this? Horrible shower. Well, I'm sorry about that. Can you drink from this person or rot her? What are you doing? Can I drink from you, please? Yes. Do it. What in the actual crap? Okay, why is that not working? Can you drink from kids? I think that's really shady if you can. No, you can just command them. I was like, that's going to be some shady business, but I was about to do it. <laughs> oh my goodness. Where can we go? What? That was weird. I thought this was like a bed, like a really not like, okay, hear me out. Hear me out. I thought like, the wheelbarrow part was like a headboard and then it was like, it was like a giant bed. And I was like, why is there a giant bed? Rot her. But it's not. I'm just being crazy. Can I actually go here or is this just like a fake? It's a fake. It's a phony. You're a fraud. Okay. Uh, <gasps> can I harvest these? No. I just want plant matter. Okay, you know what? We're going to go ahead and actually travel with him. So I decided to come to the park because um, I knew something special about this park. I knew that they had planter boxes and you can purchase seeds at planter boxes. We can only afford probably one packet, but we're gonna do some starter fruits because I really wanna start growing strawberries as soon as humanly possible. And the reason for that is because I really want us to have a girl and there is nothing against my Sim eating some freaking strawberries that her husbando harvested for her. Okay. Okay. So, um, also there should be people here that I can try to compel to drink from. So drink plasma. Why? I don't know why. Hold on. Command to work out. Command to me. Command to leave. No. Uh, why don't I ask for a small drink and see if that goes over better? I don't know if he can actually drink. Like I really don't. And if this doesn't work, we're going to have to go to the library computer and get some help. Why is this not working? Is it? Oh, is he tired? No. Okay. Let me take a look at this. I think this is my bad. 
guilty drinker. Too much empathy for prey means stress when drinking. I'm only prey the points. Because I think if we get mesmerized with Caleb, that's going to be legitimate. Uh, is there anything else I can do at this park? Like, maybe I need to be friends with someone. You know what? Let's try. Let's try to be friends with this guy real fast. Stop talking to the gardener. He's garbage. All right. There we go. All right. Uh, Brighton day. We're just gonna, we're just gonna move in on this friendship as much as possible. Let's ask him to cloud gaze, dude. Cloud gazing makes all friendships better. Honestly, this could be our first friend. I'm gonna take a picture. Take a picture. It'll last longer, boo. All right. He's actually going to cloud gaze with us. Oh, I love the way my Sim looks. I think we gave him a really nice makeover. We didn't change too much, but we made him like cute enough. Look at them being friends. Cute. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Oh, <gasps> he's a secret agent. Oh, don't be weird. Don't be weird. Hey, who's this guy? I don't know. Boy, those chops need to go. Who are you? The, like, boy, I'm pretty sure this was out. Like, mm, I don't know. Maybe a hundred years ago. Like, maybe a several hundred needs to go. Like, forget about snatching weaves. I'm about to be snatching chops because it's just not cute. Oh, can I harvest? No, but I can water. Oh, let me water these. That actually helps me right now. If I water these, that like helps my water, water. If I do that, it helps my uh, botanist, I think. What am I? Freelance botanist, yeah. What? I didn't know they gained neutralist. That's really cool. I've never done the freelance botanist. I've never done like any gardening in game because I'm a pleb. Nice, we just got six of 10. And we have that starter pack. Oh, I think we only have to click it once. My bad. There we go. Okay, you know what? He's pretty... Heck yeah, Aiden's my son. All right, I'm going to go ahead and head home and maybe try planting some of this stuff. And then we're going to try for a baby, guys. Aw, her painting is kind of cute. Uh, we're going to go ahead and sell this... Wait, What? Oh, resume. Okay, so she's not done. Oh my gosh, he's so thirsty. He is going to be pissed. Uh, what? What? Oh, that's what this is. Okay, I was like, <gasps> I thought it was... <sighs> okay, I'm not going to tell you what I thought that was. I thought it was something else, and I'm being silly. I thought it was like some kind of food, and I was like, what? Where are my seeds? But not. Nah, it's cool. They're here. All right, let me come over here, and I'm going to see if we can plant this stuff. Okay, let's put the grapes back here and we'll put bananas right her. <gasps> yes. Okay. We're going to follow him to do this. I don't know if he's going to be in the mood to woohoo his wife, but we're going to try at the end because we need that baby girl to be our next heir, you know, which we're not even close to having another heir. Like we're just not. Oh, why are you mad? What was that? Did you see that? He got all pissed. All right, there's that. And we have one more and then we have to water. Can we water them too? <gasps> we can, yes. I wish we'd gotten one more fruit out of that. That would have been nice. Dude, look at you being freaking gardening Joe. This is awesome. I've never done this. This is so fun. I'm like, I'm genuinely having a good time playing this series. I hope it shows. I really do. That was real cool. Okay. He's done gardening now. Let's go. What's this? Chat. No, you don't need to chat. It's fine. It's fine. Uh, let's go ahead. Are you, did you finish this? Okay. I need you to go sell that to a gallery. And then we're going to come here and try for a baby. So let's follow her. We actually haven't really seen her very much this episode at all. We've been really spending more time with Caleb and it's because it was been daytime and that's honestly what we really needed. 
So we're going to try not to have them hibernate until daytime in the next part. I'll probably try to start the next part at night so we can spend more time hanging out with Evelyn because I feel like we just didn't really see her in this up. All right, let's see how it's going. Oh, uh-huh. She's all happy about that. You go, Glen Coco. You get that booty. You get that vampire booty. It's gonna, it's gonna be real. It's gonna be lit. Let's be real. Wait, what the heck is this? What is this? Why do I have this? I don't know. Let's watch this woohoo action. Oh. This vampire woohoo, though. This vampire woohoo. I'm loving it. I love that it plays music too. Like I know it plays music when you do the normal woohoo as well, but I feel like this is really great too. <laughs> I really do. I really do. It's beautiful. It's honestly beautiful. I love there's like little hearts too. And they're like the perfect little hearts. Like, are these not like the most perfectly drawn hearts you've ever seen? Like Sims art team, you guys, your skills. Oh, oh God. <laughs> you know, I'm just doing my thing with my spouse, all of the sudden, bats. Do you really think that wouldn't end horribly, like, with screaming sims? Because I gotta tell you, <laughs> that would turn me off real fast. Okay, uh, she wants to kiss him, but we're actually going to have her... Oh, we don't have a toilet. Oh my gosh, we actually have to buy a toilet. We have to buy a toilet. This is really dumb because they don't need toilets, but I really want to take a pregnancy test. And I know the tests aren't mandatory, but okay, we're going to buy one of these toilets too, but not obviously for her to pee on because <laughs> wouldn't that be something like, oh yeah, we're going to take our pregnancy test on this, on this. Okay. Uh, I'm going to put this right there. Um, I also just need to grab real fast. I'm not going to do like a speed build through this part because I feel like... We just need, like, seriously the cheapest toilet we can find because we don't ever have to use it other than for pregnancy tests. All right, so we're going to go take a test and find out. We're going to find out if we are actually with child. All right, we're going to come in here. Who is calling my man right now? Like, what the heck? What an actual crap. All right, so I actually think before we find out, you guys, this is going to be the perfect place to end. So with that creepy look on her face, like, yeah, I am peeing on a stick. What are you going to do about it? Anyways, you guys, thank you so very much for watching this episode. Again, let me know what you think of the new editing and play style that I've been doing. I really am having a good time. So I hope that you guys like it. And uh, please don't forget to follow me on Instagram and Twitter. I am at CoffeeYT. And also on Twitch. Sorry, I had to think about that. My shameless plug just totally got ruined. Me. <laughs> Only me. Only me would ruin that. Something that I've been saying for the last, like, at least year and a half since I rebranded to coffee. Yeah, only I would mess that up. Anyways, you can also follow me on Twitch where I stream at least three to four days a week. Actually, I think it is four days. Four days a week. I stream four days a week, guys. And uh, we've been playing a lot of Sims 3 over there. It's been real fun. Link is always down below for you. And I will see you guys in a future episode. This is Coffee, signing off. Bye, guys.